what used to be Sam and Kyle will always become Kyle and Sam, Sam and Kyle, inseparable. Your identity has shifted and will shift as you say your vows today in front of everybody. Some part of each individual become inseparable from the other person's identity. Sam, you've become the most determined, compassionate, and loving big sister we could have ever asked for. Not to mention, you are the most beautiful bride. And I'm not just saying that because we look alike. <laughs> Sam, thank you for being the best big sister and greatest role model. We will forever be gr thankful to be your little sisters. Obviously, we were really tight in high school. We went our separate ways. Um, he went to Crooks and I went to Superior. Um, but every time that we got together after that, we were able to pick up right where we left off. So, um, um, Kyle, you've always been like a brother to me, man. And nothing makes me happier than seeing you happy with Sam. So. Amazing. Thank you. You look beautiful. Thank you, honey. <laughs> <laughs> Worth the suspense, huh? Oh my god. <laughs> you look gorgeous. Thank you. Look at you. <laughs> Sam, I promise to love and cherish you through all of life's journeys. I promise to be loyal and faithful to you, hold your hand through the good and bad times, and encourage you to follow your dreams. I pledge to not only be your husband, but a life partner and friend as we embark on this journey together. Kyle. Never in my wildest dreams did I think God would bless me by answering my prayers for a best friend, life partner, and love of my life all in one. You and I both know that I'm very indecisive. I can't even pick where we order takeout. <laughs> but if there's one decision I am completely confident in, it's deciding to take you as my husband. I promise to love you with all my heart for every second of every day. I promise to always be your biggest fan, confidant, and partner to be loyal and faithful to you, to always live in truth, to give you my whole heart. Through all the good and the bad, I promise to never let you walk alone for the rest of our days. You're my everything, and this is my vow to you. Kyle and Sam. It is with enormous privilege and honor and by the powers invested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Kyle, you have a full minute to kiss your bride.
We've never seen someone make Sam as happy as you do, and we couldn't have picked somebody better to be her husband. We can't wait to see what your future together has in store. Welcome to the family, Kyle, and congrats on gaining two more kick-ass sisters. <laughs> And if you know Sam, she's such a kind-hearted person. She's so caring. She, she always puts other people um, before herself. And um, I think that what's, that's what makes her such a good nurse and what's going to make you such a good wife to Kyle. So, um, Sam, I hope you know that I love you like a sister, even though sometimes I can be kind of that annoying little, or older brother, I guess, you know. Um, but there's no one I'd rather give up my best friend status to than you, so... Kyle and Sam understand that in order for their marriage to thrive, they need to put the other person first. And at a minimum, they need to elevate their communication and consideration and compassion for each other. They know that. They know that when they say, I do or I will, they are promising a life in pursuit of constant mutual submission. It's a beautiful thing. <laughs> 